is now a verb. The universe. Because the hour is too early and I'm rejecting that. Nope. 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 There should be no morning hour. No, I'm not finished yet. There should be a morning hour. I like the morning, but I like the morning when the sun is up. There should be no morning hour when the sun is down. It should just be night when the sun is down and morning when the sun is up. But this hour, nope. Nope. But trying to will a different kind of nature into existence is not going to help get my baby out of bed. Shoo. <laughs> Shoo, get out of bed. No, I like you here. <laughs> I don't want you to go anywhere. I was just joking. It was a joke. <laughs> no, but it's not a joke because I know you have to go. But I don't want you to, but I do want you to because I want you to be able to do all the things you have to do. But I don't want you to, because all the things I want to do are lie here with you. <laughs> do you see the conflict? Do you see the twists and turns and turmoil of my sunless morning? Hmm. <sighs> <laughs> I love that you play with me. <laughs> yeah. I love how playful you are with me. You're so fun. Especially in the morning. Uh, I think it's because in the morning, especially in sunless mornings it's just too early for you to start like like, like filtering your actions and I think that if you knew how fun you are unfiltered it would be a whole new world <laughs> I can get this you all the time Sometimes you're just too snuggly because if you're this snuggly at sunless morning hour, then neither one of us are gonna get up and you have to get up. <laughs> you make me happy. <laughs> yeah. I wish you would never look so surprised when I tell you that. <laughs> you have a really cute surprise face, though. <laughs> so, 
You win some, you lose some. <laughs> I love running my hands over this face. I love massaging my fingertips through your hair. No, but I'm gonna knock you out at this rate. We gotta get you out of bed. You got an exciting... Well, <laughs> maybe that's a leap. You have an important day. important day ahead of you. You're an important person to many people, including myself. Hmm, everybody's looking forward to seeing Zoom, <laughs> wherever people are, people are always happy to see you. Strangers on the sidewalk, etc., etc. Which means, for that reason alone, you gotta, you gotta get up. <sighs> Cannot leave the people hanging. You gotta give the people what they want. <laughs> You gotta feed the machine. <laughs> oh, I'd give you a little massages, but I don't want to knock you out. I'm trying really hard to be a little less affectionate so we can get you out of bed, but mm, selfishly, I will always always, always want you here with me. You know, the simple solution to this is that I too get out of bed, but I don't think I'm strong like you. <laughs> <laughs> now this is a good place, this bed. And you're a good person in this bed. But don't let me be a bad influence on you. <laughs> Which, come to think of it, is rather typical. <laughs> no, but... Mm. I just like you so much. I like your depth, and I like your sense of humor. <laughs> you make me smile. But this isn't about me. This is about you getting up. And this is me being a supportive of that. You're too cute for me to keep here all to myself. That would be awfully Disney villainy of me to just keep you to myself. It's downright selfish and rude. And oh no. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I do owe you an apology, though. In all of this being supported, rubbish, 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 I haven't kissed you yet this morning. <laughs> Come here. Nope. No more. <laughs> 
<laughs> you have to get you out of bed. <laughs> you see, I can be strong too. <laughs> Do you want me to just push you out? <laughs> I could just give you a good shove and then you'd be out. And then that would be that. It would be a quick, swift push. You'd hit the ground, but I think that would wake you up further. It wouldn't be such a bad thing, wouldn't it? <laughs> See, this works in theory, but I don't think I have the heart pull it off, so I'll have to think of something else. Mm. Actually, true story though, I had a friend who had a crash in my place for a while, and we would like, you know, do like work, like we would do like little work parties during the day if we were working from home or something, like on the couch. And sometimes I would like start to drift off on the couch or I'd, you know, take a little nap on the couch or something and he'd swing by and I'd be like, hey, like, wake me up and he would literally just like, he was this giant like, goliath man and he would just literally like throw me off and <laughs> I'd hit the ground and I'd say, thank you. And he'd be like, you're welcome. <laughs> we'd go about our day. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not kidding. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> it's a very specific method. It's not for everyone, but it was certainly for me. So what I'm saying is, if you think that method is for you, I could do some push-ups and I could train for it. <laughs> no, I'm out of shape now. I was in such good shape for so long. And then I, you know, got depressed and lost it. <laughs> But I gotta discipline myself to get back to shape Because I always, I always feel better about myself when I'm stronger Physically, you know, it's just a convenient thing to be on earth <laughs> To have more muscle, you can do more things Like throw the people you love on the floor or, or carry groceries Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know when I'm being in a drift off And yeah, that's okay, but I want to get you out of bed first I want to see you off Or maybe I don't. Maybe if I just fall asleep now, I can pretend you stayed in bed with me. But no, because I'm supportive and I should be happy to see you off. Go away. <laughs> okay, here's an impetus. Did you know? Did you know that the bed is haunted? Yeah. And the bed told me that if, um, uh, if you don't go, that it's gonna eat us like a cartoon. Like it's gonna grow teeth and just eat us. Yeah, it told me that. So you better go. <laughs> now we can take the bed. Dream team, baby. We can take it. So don't worry about that. All you need to worry about is the fact that you're fantastic. And that the world needs you and... You're just like Superman. I'm sorry, Batman. There's a big... There's a big Batman sign in the sky. There's a big bat signal waiting for you. You can't see it, but I can see it. That's right there. Just follow my finger up to the roof. You can't see it, but I can see it. It's right there. And the whole world wants you 
So it's time, it's time, it's time. Okay, baby. <laughs> this is always the hard part, isn't it? Where do you go in the morning? But that's good. That's just a, an obvious testament as to how wonderful you are. And who would I be if I kept you all to myself? <laughs> I'm gonna nuzzle your nose with my nose. <laughs> okay, gorgeous. I think I've significantly made you giggle enough that you're probably feeling just a little perkier. Perky enough to get out of bed. Give me that cheekbone. <laughs> mm, you're so soft. No, nope, but you gotta go. <laughs> Out. Spot. Out. That's a Shakespearean quote, but that's too dark in context for this morning. Don't worry about a thing, but just tell. You're awesome, and you're up, and you're doing all the hard things that most people wouldn't do. Like get up at sunless morning hour. And I'm very proud of you. That's a promising way. Promising way to start the day. Even though I hate it. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna become really boring for you now. I'm gonna roll over. So that you have all the more reason to get up. Don't cuddle me. <laughs> Do not cuddle me. That is a slippery slippery slope. That is the slippery slope of all. <laughs> hey, guess what? I love you. much as we want, and yet still get out on time to do all the things, all of your wonderful things. Yeah, I'll be dreaming of that. And just thinking about how gorgeous you are, and how proud of you I am. And how inspiring you are to, to get up at sunless morning hour, and then maybe one day I will too. <laughs> but for now, I'll just dream about it. For now, I'll just take that step. <laughs> Go get him, tiger. 